Hey everyone, Foxlo back again and um, I'm in the mood to start a new game so I'm starting a new game and we're going to do not Target. Project Genius wanna fly wherever you want, whenever we're you going want. to do Spear of the Patriarch While Patriarch Rankar failed his subjects Patriarch Zayart made a name for himself fighting the Xenon When the jump gate shut down disconnected the realms Zayart, the Provident, prevented the split families around him from drifting apart. After the gate realigned, Zayart, the Undying, had outlived all but wrecked Tikiar from the Patriarchs of old. Now it is time to pick up the shards of Ronkar's empire and follow the Turok's steps as High Patriarch Zayart shall unify all split once again. We will welcome them all, outcasts, exiles, and even the accursed, back into split society. So let's go, this is going to be quite challenging. As a proud member of Family Newt, I joined Zayart's expeditionary fleet to prove my worth to the Empire. Being recognized as an equal among the warriors has never been easy, but it is in my nature to defy tradition. Cool. So yeah, this is going to be um, a bit more of a challenging start because you're not friends with many very people as a split, especially the Argon. <laughs> so yeah, it's going to be a bit. I've already um, got a name for my new character, the dear little Miss Split. She's going to be Nardine Fish, and her company name is going to be. The fish, obviously. <laughs> I'm not sure it's going to be the, not Enterprise something. Let's have a look. Um, just thinking. Maybe the Fish Core Corporation. Mm, we'll see. But yeah, it's going to be a bit challenging because of the fact that most of the sectors that I like to have um, stuff in, we can't do that because the Argon will shoot all our stuff. I'm not sure about Talardi, I don't think they're that bad against the Talardi, but um, yeah, it's going to be a hard start. But again, we can um, find Bozo. I did do a test run, I did it um, as far as finding Bozo, and I found him. Didn't get to him yet, obviously, so now we're going to start again, so let's see what happens. And in his wisdom, the Patriarch of all split graciously offers to accept your capitulation. Surrender now, and your executions will be honorable and swift. He's dead. <laughs> they don't give you a chance to fight anything. Good. No more useless negotiations. <laughs> Inform the fleet. All pilots, you have performed as expected. Distraction dealt with. Military campaign against wretched Argon creatures can continue. Patriarch expects True Split to show initiative. Mission completed. Barely an inconvenience. Okay, cool. <laughs> I like this. I do like the <coughs> the ass. <coughs> Excuse me, but it's a bit weak. But then, yeah, you know, to start shit. We got mi missiles and that that beam one. What's it called? What they called, can't remember what they called. Um, burst rays. Not bad actually. But they don't fire for very long. So, where are we now? We are in, look at this. Fires of victory. Right, the first thing to do is let's find some stations. So, let's do a um, scan. We can see them obviously, look, I can see them over there. We we'll still do a scan. Let's stop the ship for a second because another thing I always do um, when you start, make sure you get your glo global set first before you forget. So do your global settings, go to global. 
Um, where are we? Default global response to attack. Now, the, the uh, default one, you want it so that none of your ships, no, not retaliate, you stupid her, escape. Because again, you need to do, I would do miners. Notify me, escape. Default global response to police interdiction, leave that to incomply, but don't have to notify me. Default uh, response to pirate harassment, not attack, escape. Notify me if the incident occurs. Um, found abandoned ship, not ignore. Claim if possible. Now that claim if possible is if they've got um, marines on board. Um, default global response to a found lockbox. Ignore, but don't notify me. Um, contraband, notify no. Deploy, drop, destroyed. Mm, uh, no, shall I put that? Ignore drop crates, that's it. Default, preferred mule be best, build metal food is universal, leave that, leave that as is. Ship weapon and child braver, leave that on defend. Um, that's basically it really for that. Let's look at our factions, now as we've only got two, we've got plus ten with the Zaya Patriarchy, which is caused what you start with. Three families were at minus five, so we've got to get that rep up a bit. Okay, well I haven't seen any of the others yet. So basically that's what I do initially. Um, where are we? Empire. Rayo to Naru, but her name's going to be Nadine. Nadine Fish. Let's see <coughs> why I called her Nadine Fish in a minute. Um, now the organisation name, let's have a look. Um, we could just put it, uh, mm, I know what, Nadine Industries, that's better, Nadine Industries, cool, and logo, my own one again, but it's the fish, it's a cool one. Okay, the only ones I haven't used so far now is this one and this one. I won't use my own Fox Oak one. Well, I, I won't say never, that is possible. Right, let's get on. We, we, oh, there's a station there, but... We need to discover all the stuff in here and get some rep. So let's see... Unknown what, station. What that one is. So yeah, we're not very friendly with the Argon, obviously. I don't know about the Paranid and um, Teladi, but we'll see how it goes. Oh, sugar. Space Fuel Factory. But we don't want to go near that. They'll shoot us. See what I mean? Argon Federation, minus 21. Um, yeah, it's going to be a bit hard. <laughs> Let's just, I want to test something out. We're probably going to die, but I want to test it. See if they're going to fire on us. So let's save the, do a first save. I'm going to do it on empty number three, and we'll call it... Nardine Fish. So, you can name your save, you see. So that's on number three. Save. Okay, what I want to find out, obviously, I think they will fire on us, but let's, let's see what happens. We'll do a quick flyby, see if their guns open up. I'm sure they will, if they've got any, because they probably have. We're not firing. Why aren't they firing? <laughs> hmm. It's got to have guns. I'm just trying to check. Or could we actually get a rep? I can't target that. It's not letting me target. 
Argon Station security vessel. No, we don't want to shoot that. But he's not firing at us. We definitely can't Docking land. Not possible. There's no docks between your ship, guys. What? Oh, him. <laughs> Argon Station security vessel. Short range transporter. A. Hmm. Space fuel factory. Docking denied. Of course it is. Well, I just want to test this out. They're obviously not firing at us. Maybe they'll only fire at you when you're at level 30. Hmm, a bit strange. I'm just trying to find out if we can actually kill a spawn Argon Station security vessel criminal if that actually um, produces a result. Uh, there, security vessel. Argon Station security vessel. I just saw another one pop up. There's three here somewhere. Mass transporter C. Argon Station security vessel. No, okay. Where's the other one? Space fuel factory. He's up. Hmm. Yeah, they're not firing, are they? So we won't tempt fate. I was just hoping maybe a criminal will pop out. Well, let's unlock the missile so I don't accidentally shoot rockets. That's civilian ship A. Ah, he's a criminal. Let's see what happens. You stop now, please. Now, see if our rep goes up. We'll wait for the message. Short range transporter A. Mass transporter B. Argon Station security vessel. Mm. Come on, tell me that you thank me. Go on. And we get the up to minus 20. Because normally the first one will take um, one point up. So could we actually get friendly with them? I'm waiting for the message. <gasps> No message is coming. Thanks for your help. Oh, look at that. Yeah, there you go, it works. So we could actually get the rep up this way. Mind you, once you've got one from them, um, it takes a while for the second one to come on the same station. So yeah, anyway, let's get on. What we need to do, we need to find Bozo, so... Hmm... Let's go to these others. Unknown station. I won't clear the sector yet. We'll do that a bit later. Now I did start this start for a practice run and I found Boso at the first station that I came to. Whether I get the same result now is a bit ma different matter. You see, if we can, we could do the the Bozo quest because Bozo will send us to a um, anomaly in this sector, which will take us to Grand Exchange One. <clears throat> but I don't know whether to actually do that yet because right now I think we've got. this to do, provide paving the way. It says very hard because you've got to um, aid the Patriarch in conquering these sectors or take them for yourself like Guiding Star 4, 5, Guiding Star 7, uh, six, yeah, 7, 5, 6, 7 and 11th hour which is... where are we? Up here. So we've got to go to two grand anyway. We can get there and go up that way. But there's no way at this stage of the game that you're about to conquer that up there. 
um, no way at all so it's, that's why it's hard it's going to be um, slightly impossible right now with the money we've got we've only got 5,000 credits so we need to do some crystal mining to make some initial money but at the moment it's a bit difficult here because there's no roids obviously in this sector but I want to find Bozo first if we can so scanner on oh look at this civilian ship B see our rep is with uh, three families is only minus five so it shouldn't take too long but um medical supply factory okay Let's see if we can find a sparkly for Pozo. The likelihood is now I'm recording. I don't get it on the first station. <gasps> ah! Such law. Sixteen percent. And I can't really we need to get satellites but I don't have the money yet thanks for your help thank you up to minus four call I do like the split as well and we need a pilot as well but we can't afford one at the moment come on We're not discovering these for some reason. <laughs> See? Where, oh! I can hear one. Where is it? Yeah, I know. I can hear it. You don't need to tell me. I can hear it, but I can't, can't see it. Get the other side. I can hear it in my left earpiece. Where are we? I'll go away. Let's get rid of this HUD. Oh, we've come away from it. So it's ah, there it is. I can see it. I can see the sparkly look. Now, are you bozo. I hope you are. I have work that needs to be. Ah, no. Are you interested in a job? Not bozo. Keep the peace. No, we don't want to do that right now. Thank you. No, it's not Bozo. Oh, another one. I think this is him. There we go. I had to disable my voice filter. I was beginning to think my messages were being intercepted by those split fellows. I'm a little disappointed that it was this easy. I don't suppose they sent you, did they? Oh, that would be quite devious. <laughs> Who are they? Hmm, what should I call them? I suppose captors is quite apt. Employers? They let me work on my own projects some days, you see. Do you need help? Ah, yes, you see. I'm in a spot of bother. bother. I'm in the middle of some important scientific research which I'm unable to pursue personally from my current location. I'm looking for an assistant to aid me. What do you need? I'll send the task to your ship computer. This is rather exciting. Well, we're going to accept it, so accept. Wonderful. I have managed to place the device on a nearby docking area. You should be getting the coordinates now. Okay, now we've got a dock. Docking granted. Gotta pick up that device. So he can keep track of us. <laughs> and of course this ship hasn't got computers so we've got to manually dock. Wait, wait, green. Forward a bit. Forward a bit more. Stop. Left a bit. Down. There we go. Successfully docked. Welcome. Welcome. 
The yellow brick load. Oh, there it is, look. Wait. Very good. I see you have found the device. This will allow me to monitor your activity and perform experiments remotely. Please keep it safe. Okay. Oh my! It seems your pulse is elevated. You must be very excited <laughs> to take part in this expedition. Oh, absolutely. So, shall we begin? I will yeah. attempt to direct you in the best way possible. Please be patient with me. Undock. Now he's going to send us to an anomaly. Oh, is that Civilian another? ship. Where are you? I don't expect you've spoken with too many Boron before. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Bozo Tar, and it is a pleasure. I do wish it were in person, but my current situation is quite precarious. You must be quite curious on what a lonely old Boron is trying to achieve. There are still so many mysteries and unanswered questions. Are spacefly sentient? Where are the lost Boron systems? Is faster than light telepathy possible? It is our task to push the physics of this universe to the breaking point and see if it answers any of those questions. My current employers only seem happy when my research results in novel weapon modifications. Very curious people, those split. Well, I'm split. I do hope they move <laughs> me to a new tank soon. My, my tentacles grow weak. weak. <laughs> it's so cool. Again, I love the boron. It's so cool. Um. I do wonder how my homeworld is faring. It has been such a long time since we have had news of it. So now he wants us to go to that. That's obviously an anomaly. Let's just double check it. To get actually gets picked up. Let's put the HUD back on. No, it doesn't. It's too far away for the scan to scan it. Let's have a look. Unknown zone. Yeah. Um, I'm just wondering. Do I go straight into it? We might do. Um, yeah. Let's go into it. Let's go and do his mission straight off. I sometimes leave it normally and I start. I'd leave it for a while, but if it can get us to Grand Exchange. Then we can mine some crystals, I can make some money. And also find out what we're like with the Taladi. Right, let's get close to it then. Wait a minute, have we got any... Yeah, we should have. Because he's going to ask us to drop a satellite. Yeah, we've got... Oh, we've only got three. We normally have five. Hmm. have to be a bit conservative with the uh, satellites. Right, let's go. Scientific area. That's going to take us to Grand Exchange One. It's definitely going to be an anomaly. He's going to ask us to scan. Come on then, let's get there. 28, don't go too quite past it. 10. You appear to be getting close to where I detected an anomaly. There you go. Could you please try using the long range scanner to search for an anomaly in this vicinity? Aha! Ah. There it is! Where? If I don't see it. Believed, these anomalies are tears, which may lead to other areas of space, much like the jump gates. I suggest you mark the location of the anomaly on your map. So, how adventurous do you feel today? Thanks to ah. my research, I do have a fair idea of where you may end up. Of course, the quickest way to confirm my theory is to put it into practice. Fly into the anomaly. Okay, let's... Mm, shall I drop one here? Because we haven't got many. Now let's stop. What have we got? Let's have a look. We've got a nav beacon, we've only got two. Um, we're going to need one on the other side. Let's drop a satellite here then. 
So we've got two. We're going to need two for the other side as well. Um, hmm. Let's just drop one here. And then name it. Wait. Come on. I want, oh, we're right down the closest we can anyway. Satellite. Information. Anomaly. Okay. Okay, let's go through it. We have to boost through it, don't we? Oh, we're not close to it yet. And we'll be in Grand Exchange 1 where we can friggin' get some crystals, hopefully. That's how we're going to have to make our money. I've already done that. There we go. Entering system, Grand Exchange. Now we need to drop another one. Can you hear me? It took a moment to realign the frequency. It is just as I thought. You have made it through the anomaly and emerged in a distant region. Your location is actually of great interest to me. Over the years, I have managed to pull sensor logs from passing ships to help further my work. I highlighted this as a prime location for my research, should I ever get the chance. While the previous anomaly is interesting, my findings point to something else here, which I expect will lead to a groundbreaking discovery. Allow me to guide you to a particular area. Okay. We're going to have to drop another one here, so we've just got enough, I think. We've got one left, haven't I? Yeah, one satellite left and a nav beacon. is going to ask us to drop a nav beacon as well. So let's go over to there. Empty space. And then we'll go and hunt some crystals. And I've got the crystal mod on so they're easier to find and also they spawn more regularly. They, the crystal in the uh, vanilla game has been nerfed really badly. So they're very, very hard to find in a vanilla play, uh, playthrough. But again, this is modded. I've got two mods on here, so... One's a crystal and one's a paint I'm one. currently evaluating what equipment we will need to make the most of this location. Space here is wounded, with a scar in his fabric which seems to have healed multiple times. There is no record of any abnormal activity at these sites. To everyone else, this is simply an empty area of space. In my search for signals from long lost Boron, I have detected multiple scars in space which continue to spew a multitude of particles and radiation. In a bustling sector such as this, it would only be seen as background noise. However, some of the noise seems to have artificial form. We are going to tear this scar wide open and peer inside. Of course, the universe is a fickle thing. One miscalculation, and we may well destroy the whole system. Ha! Such stakes make this all the more exciting. <laughs> cool. Before we get started, allow me to reimburse you for your help so Cool, he's going to give us some money. Don't mind me using their credit account to help fund <laughs> our venture. So he's given us 25k, cool. Now, now, come on. The experiment. You will first need to place a satellite around this area in order for us to better understand its nature and how best to provoke the anomaly. Okay, I so... I suggest you also deploy a resource probe so that we can see how the anomaly has affected the local environment. You should be able to acquire these deployable items from stations which offer upgrades. I know of such a station near your location. I will add the information to your map. Deploy one satellite, so that's one here. So I've only got one left. Cool. Ah, good work. I'm receiving a much clearer signal from the tear. Almost immediately, I can see that there are far more gravimetric shears here compared to any other anomaly ever documented. That indicates mass, but of what? The 
this shows some similarities with a jump gate event horizon. But there is something else. Could it be a temporal distortion? Uh -oh. Perhaps dimensional. Very interesting. I can't fight more than one. Right, so let's deploy a resource probe in the specified area. I'm curious of this environment. <clears throat> Okay, I've got to buy one because we haven't got any, but... Queen's Guard. Oh, it's a Queen's Guard. If there's more than... Well, there's going to be more than one. How many are there? With this ship, if there's more than one of them, it's going to be quite difficult to survive. Oh, friggin' hell, there's a whole group of them. We need to get away from them for the time being. Let's... Yeah. Where's the station? Where's the station? I can't see a station anywhere. I just saw one earlier. And now I can't see it in the... Let's just get away a bit. There's no way we can fight five of them with this ship. We'll get marmalized. <clears throat> and there's bound to be five of them there. Four or five. Let's just get over here a bit. And then we'll save. Okay, stop. Let's do another save. Nardine fish. Okay. Well, that's a find somewhere to buy. Um, I know you said you've marked it up, but from experience, you never find. Oh, we're going to that close. Asteroid. No, him. See, he's getting us down already. Ah. I'm trying to stay behind him now. Oh, he's a lot faster. He keeps on pulling out. He's already got a shield down, look. See, this ship is very weak. Stay behind him. This is scripted in here, always happens. I'll try and stay behind him. I'm strafing like mad here. Away. Mm. Just put my finger on the trigger and that's it. Stay behind him. Oh, it's so weak. You drop anything? Anything good? No. Container. High energy catalyst. No. So we might drop a uh, sator item, which he didn't. Um. Okay. Let's have a look. Smart chip factory. Oh, they're Bluetooth. Now normally he said he's marked uh, 18 billion, yeah look he's marked, this is what he's marked up. This is where we can buy him from. So he's marked up that sector, 18 billion. I like that music. So we can buy it once we find the gate for it. Um, I'm thinking that's just 34 minutes in, let's see if we can, oh no, not another one. Forager. Ah, good. They keep get them out of the way, guy. They keep boosting away. It's a good thing the 
The guns don't overheat that much, but they don't do much damage. <laughs> Mind you, these are a bit weaker. But those two that are up on our left arm. <laughs> oh. Come on, stay near him. Container. Forager. Another one. Oh. Yeah, he's boosting. Please don't go near your mate. If we get more than one on us, we're dead. We're getting too close to his mate. All right, let's get out of the way for a minute. I'm not going to risk it. Let's go over here. See, there's a... We could go through the rift again. Let's see. See where it takes us. No, that ain't it. What's that? I'm thinking that's the rift and it's a friggin' roid. <gasps> that, I thought was the rift for a minute. <gasps> or the anomaly. I'm looking for crystals now, quickly. Let's have a look. They're enemies 55, 53, 54. I don't think they're following us. Although I've got the mod on and they spawn more crystals than the uh, vanilla, you still have to find them. Is that a green one there? Or is it just green? Let's have a look. See some of these <coughs> Astros have green stripes on them but they don't hold a crystal. Like this one here, yeah, no, I don't think that's got one. Okay, let's take the hut off, it makes it easier. Oh, there's a white one. Be the cheapy ones. But, still money. There. Oh, let's grab them. Oh, there's a more, another white one over there. <coughs> now, where's the crystal? Where is it? Is that it there? Oh, no, it's there, look. I need to get a bit closer. There we go. Ah. Oh, come on. Oh, that's it. Grab all the others. Cool. That'll give us some money. Grab these white ones. Come on, get a nice orange. Oh, purple one. Purple one. Nice. They're not the best, but they're the second best. There's that one there, and there's one on this little one. Let's make sure we stay in the same, because it's that big one there. The thing is, if you get this, while getting this one, we could get disoriented and not find that other one again, which is quite possible. Wait. Come on. So weak these guns. <laughs> okay, we got all them. Asteroid. Alright, the other one is over there. Mittening. See how it's easier to find them with this uh, mod on, it's so cool. Oh, it's telling that. Where's the crystal? That's it there, isn't it? Come on, get it all. 
shit all of them got. My legal item. I'm not gonna keep them on me for now. Let's see how much we've made if we can. I need to repair my um, hull as well before we get attacked again. Let's see how much we've got. 470k. Hmm. Out of that lot to start, but let's. Repair the hole before we get attacked. Ask. Stop, 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 stop. Ah. I just re just realised I, I should have used my rockets on those um, GAC. I forgot I got rockets as well. I think just out of interest, let's go back to the anomaly once I've done this. See if we can go through, see if it sends us back to um, our start position or a different sector. It could send us to a different sector. So we're going to have to do that. Once we're repaired. There we go. Docking granted. afford a pilot now as well. Right, let's find uh, where are we? Where's the anomaly satellite? This is why I name the satellites. Where are we? Target it. Satellite. Let's go through it again. It's uh <coughs> It sends you to random sectors, so, um, but sometimes it can send you back to the same sector you started in. So now we need to scan to find out its proper position. It's going to be near here. Not this side. I think we just passed it, didn't we? Oh, come on. Don't say I can't find it again. There it is. Cool. Yeah, we're up. <coughs> thought I'd pass it. I thought I saw a glimpse of it when we come towards this satellite. Let's see where it sends us. Could actually send us back to here, where we are now. It's sending us. It's repelling us now. Look, our speed is going down. Go. Entering system. Ias mists. Oh, he sent us a pie smith. <laughs> Are they blue to us or what? Let's have a look. Oh, they're blue to us. So now we've uh, discovered the pioneer -nice sector. Let's have a look at what the faction... Oh, sugar. Ah, I ain't got any satellites now. I've lost the position of it. Um, quickly do a scan. Hold on. I forgot. Oh, on scan then. Oh, it was already in. There it is. Have I got anything left? I think I've got a um, navigation. Yeah, I've got a navigation beacon. We can put one of these here. Let's get a bit closer. So I don't lose this point. Oh, this is good enough where we are now. Okay, 
Okay, cool. Let's mark that one. Let's name the beacon. Okay, cool. Right, let's go through it again. Where is it now? <gasps> there we go, let's go. No, it's where is it going to send us this time? Now it's ONG, wherever it sends you, you know? Wait until it starts pushing us backwards and then boost. Now it's starting to push us back. Now go through. Entering system. Heretics end. Uh oh. Right by the gate as well. Hmm. Interesting. Let's see that. <laughs> Now let's see where this one sends us to. I'm not going to mark this one down. Got to find it again. There we go. Let's go through it. It's interesting to see where it pops you up. Boost. Entering system. Memory of profit. Cool. Another one. So that should be behind us. So let's go through it again. That is, that is. Go. Entering system. Antigone Memorial. Oh, bring it out, and it's all over the place. Oh, they're red to us, aren't they? Smart chip factory. Well, not quite red. Look. Hmm. Oh. This will now. Ah, oh, this is a good way of discovering the sectors. Ides Vanguard. Yeah, you see what I mean. Look. It's hostile. Argon Federation. The hostile minus twenty. Minus 20 now, I don't think they attack us. But this is a good way of discovering the uh, other sectors. We've got the, um, what do you call it? The travel route here. We're going there and just sitting it. And it'll do a circle around the sectors. So we'll quickly discover a lot of the sectors. So let's do that, shall we? What are we in? 48 minutes. Oh, I like this music. Just stay in the circuit until we discover, until we come back to here, Antigone Memorial. So we just stay in here. Why has it knocked us out? Oh, that's a bit weird. I thought that'd take us right the way through. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's just the other end of it. I thought it was, um... Hmm. We've got to find that again. <laughs> Let's go back to that particular area. It's just a sector one, isn't it? I thought it was a circular one. need to find that anomaly again. Okay. There we go. Let's go to it. What are we in? 50 minutes. Okay. This is a neat way of finding where all the sectors are and then you just go to the, um, each gate to um, join them all up. But if we can find one of the sectors with that circular route, the travel route, that we call. Don't lose it. Hmm. 
I'm getting near it. Not yet. Ah. Oh, I love this music. Yeah, I think we're close enough. Yeah. Danger. Has entering system. Barca's cascade. Oh no, not in here. Ah. Um. Oh, well, sugar. Where are you going to put us? We need to get out of here. Where's the main gate? That's going to kill us. Yeah, there is that problem. Um. Where's the main gate? Oh, friggin' hell! Nowhere. No, I was looking for the main gate, not the one that we saw. We're going to lose our... Oh, let's quickly go through that again. Come on. I can't boost. No, don't send us back. It sent us back. <laughs> no, I haven't got no boost left. That's it. we got to go through those gates. Or we end up dying here. Danger. Hazardous region. Yeah, I know. I <laughs> know. Need to find the gate, but um, to get out of here now. What am I talking about? Why am I doing this? The trouble is I can't, I can't boost through the, um, no I can't do it. We can't boost through the anomaly because we haven't got any shielding. Let's just get into there. Get our shielding back. Make sure the K doesn't shoot us down. <laughs> yeah there is, I forgot that option. It can send you into the naughty areas. <laughs> No, it's just Danger. <laughs> Hazardous region detected. Yeah, I know. Entering Barca's Cascade 17. Get out of the way of this lot. No, let's see. Um we're in a bit of a quandary here. Yeah? The aqueduct. Hmm. We've got to go back, really, into um, Darkest Ca Cascade 5 and go to the south area where the gate is, which is around here somewhere. So, um, now we've got our shield back. <laughs> got myself into a pickle here, haven't we? Let's go. Let's see if we make it. Oh, greenie! <laughs> got to do it. I think I want to do a save as well. Because at the moment we're still okay. This is the second cheapest one. I'll get on it. So walk when turning like that. All money if we survive. That's it. Oh, no, no, don't get stuck in it. You gotta be careful of that when it's turning because sometimes you can get stuck in it. 
And it's a bit awkward and I want these um, crystals. Okay, cool. Oh, blue one. <laughs> yeah, we've got to do it, guys. Even though I've got to get away from here somehow. We still need these crystals. <coughs> it goes from white, green, blue, mauve to orange. White being the lowest and orange being the highest. So, not bad. We're making some money here. We will be. We can sell them to any station. In the trading centre. Oh, come on. Am I actually getting the crystal? I don't think I am. There we go. <coughs> what are we in? 56 minutes. <coughs> Trying to keep it to one. Oh, we're getting all red stuff. Now, are we going to make it out of here without finding any more crystal? <laughs> Alright, let's do another quick save. Cool. Okay guys, probably what I'm going to do now... Um, I'm actually going to do a bit more crystal hunting in here. I'm not going to record it now. Uh, see how you see there's a K over there. Can you see him? <laughs> we can disable this engine. It's quite easy to disable this engine. So, so he doesn't start moving about. Hmm. Shall we do that initially? Before I call it. And then I'll hunt some things. I'm going to disable this engine. Watch. Uh, hopefully it hasn't got any fires by it. You know it's tempting fate. You know it really is. But it's fun. <laughs> This is how a little small fighter like this can... Oh no, he's got a crew. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> well, you know, if he was on his own, but not with a crew there, we wouldn't survive that. So I was going to just, you know, just disable it and leave it there. <laughs> you can disable its engines quite easily. Um, with this small craft, once we're on its back and keeping it really low, it can't target you. But, uh-oh. Who's near me? Oh, is anybody near me? M. Oh, sugar, M. Is he on his own? No, he's not on his own. Oh, no, they've, they're all coming towards me now. Let's get out of the way. Move, move, move. <laughs> Running like a big girl, but they'll just marmalize us. We'll definitely die. So if we go away a bit, they'll lose interest. Hopefully, let's untarget them. That's it. Okay, I'm going to do some crystal mining here while I'm here, guys. And then I'll start the next episode when I'm ready to move out and see if we survive. So, I hope you enjoyed that session. Um, you know, I did get myself into a pickle doing that, but we've discovered a few more sectors, albeit none of them are joined up. But, um, yeah I thank you so much if you got this far and I'll catch you look like there's one here oh they're all following me still <laughs> uh, you'll see if I survive or not guys because I've got to stay away from them anyway I'll catch you in my next one